6 12 here on your Tuesday. So, we want to get you ready for the day. Of course, the first thing to note, it is rainy out there. So, we have to plan for wet roads on the morning commute. Of course, we'll check in with Angela Foster in just a second for how that is playing out on your morning commute. But it is definitely gray out there and wet for many of you. So, current conditions, we are at 47 degrees in Baltimore. We do have those northeast winds right around 10 to 15, gusts even into the 20s. So, that's certainly making a difference as for what it feels like out there. So robbing us of five degrees feeling more like 42. At the bus stop, plan for the wet weather. You don't want to be caught without at least an umbrella, a rain jacket, something. It's going to stay soggy for the first half of the day. And then we should see dry conditions for the second half of the day and even some sunshine. So temperatures in the upper 40s, but again, because of that wind, plan for it to feel more like the low 40s. Taking a look at the very active radar scan. So a lot of this is green, indicating light to moderate showers. Where we do see yellow, that's some pockets of some heavier rain. You can see in the Baltimore area, it's mainly on the lighter side. But as you move a little bit further to the west, places like Frederick getting more of a soaking and zooming out. This is what we have to deal with as this area of low pressure just kind of pivots across spinning that rain in our direction. So this is going to be pretty persistent over the next few hours. Temperatures, there's those mid to upper 40s, a couple of you right at 50 degrees. But again, the wind is certainly making a difference as for what it feels like out there. You can see though all the progress we make as far as the rain goes. Notice the timestamp there, 11 o'clock. So by 11 o'clock noon, the majority of the rain is out of here. And then notice how quickly the clouds follow. So I do think we'll get some breaks of sun before the sun sets tonight. Now, we are tracking the return of widespread wet weather tomorrow, late in the day. I would say 4 or 5 o'clock. And then it persists, though, Wednesday night into the start of your Thursday. And then we have another round of rain to get you through Friday night into Saturday. So you need the umbrella, and then you need to keep it very handy because you'll use it off and on as the rest of the week goes on. And that does include the weekend. So our sunrise will be at 632, and then our sunset this evening at 6.03, mostly cloudy skies overnight. Wet weather here. So as I mentioned, pretty persistent chances. I think we get a brief break for at least part of Friday before this wet weather returns, unfortunately, over the weekend as well. So we'll break down your seven-day forecast in just a sec. Angela Foster, though, going to break down the commute for us, Angela. So where are these tough spots? 